Michael Myers interview, tape one. Michael, I wanted to sit down with you, me, Dr. Lemus, and discuss simply about the uh, murder of your family, or your sister. Why I want to touch on base, why did you decide to kill your sister, Michael. <laughs> Look at me like I'm the freak. Like I did something wrong that night. Hmm? I'm 13 now. 13 years old. And me cubed up in this fucking mental place. Like I'm the one who did something wrong that night. No. My family is the one who did wrong. You ever think maybe it's not the world, Dr. Loomis? Maybe it's... Well, it is the fucking world, Dr. Loomis. It's not me. It's what they fucking do to me. I mean, seriously. Seriously. That night that they left, they didn't even leave me with a fucking babysitter. They left me with my fucking sister who couldn't even watch me. And shall we discuss my fucking father? My father had a little secret problem that kept from my whole fucking family. He was an alcoholic. And not a controlled alcoholic. One who beat my fucking mother. He did it once in front of me. You can call me crazy or whatever. Do you think? No, 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 I'm fucking talking, okay? You shut your damn mouth. And you listen to me. No. I have to ask, do you think watching your father abuse your mother took a little bit of your mental mind? As a young child, something like that could potentially be traumatizing to a child. Numerous rage, I guess. I mean, a time that led me to kill a cat once. I don't know. I took my anger on the cat. I mean him for the reason why my mother got fucking beat. I cut off the cat's fucking head. Just cut off his skin. And I ate its flesh raw. Why did you do that, Michael? Because it deserved it. Everything in this world is more evil than we think. You think I'm the bad guy? Look at the world around us. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you! I think it's time we're done, Michael. Please, go back to your room. I've had enough for one day.